So, Max, tell me, what do you know about Blue Collar Story Hour, anyway? Oh, yeah, from the Jerry Show. Yeah, I've heard that. Well, it's looking like it's going to become a reality that Blue Collar Story Hour is actually going to happen. We've got some people who are ready to do read some stories, and and this comes to my attention. I need to ask you a question. So it's basically just regular guys that have regular jobs that are coming into the library and reading to the kids. So, I think you can tell where I'm going with this. Well, well what does this have to do with me exactly? Okay, here's a, here's a hint. Um, what would you think about letting us use the Pookie books? Your books. Well, I appreciate what you're saying, but the books are complicated. When they were published, mean Prudence did some illustrations. I didn't like them. She thought I was wrong, so I got my friend to do them who worked for Nordstrom. He's an excellent illustrator and at work, but that's been kind of a problem. So what you're saying is we need to call Murray the lawyer. Well, that's no big deal. Well, it's okay with me if I can get permission from Prudence. There's just a lot of murkiness and stuff with this, so I'll have to get permission. You know, I'm sure that Prudence still blames me for starting the rumor that she was the character that Pookie was based on. Well, the fact that it's true has nothing to do with it. She's still just mad at me for some reason. Well, let me know what you decide and find out. Uh, And next week we're going to do Cracker. He's got a story about a magic wrench he's going to tell the kids about. I'm looking forward to it. Little bridges, let's go down to Spooky. It don't make no riches. Remember to hit the like button, subscribe, and hit the little bell. It'll just make my day. Catch you later. I think I got it. I think I've got it.